Dave, let me ask you about uh, the iPhone and the Zune, if, if I may. The Zune uh, was getting some traction, then Steve Jobs goes to Macworld and he, he pulls out this iPhone. What was your first reaction when you saw that? $500 fully subsidized with a plan? I said, that is the most expensive phone in the world, and it doesn't appeal to business customers because it doesn't have a keyboard, which makes it not a very good email machine. Now, it may sell very well or not. I, you know, We have our strategy. We've got great Windows mobile devices in the market today. We, you can get uh, a Motorola Q phone now for $99. It's a very capable machine. It'll do music. It'll do uh, internet, it'll do email, it'll do instant messaging. So I, I kind of look at that and I say, well, I like our strategy. I like it a lot. Uh, how do you compete with that, though? He sucked out a lot of the spotlight uh, in the last few weeks because of what happened at Mac, Macworld, not only with the iPhone, uh, but with the, the new iPod. I mean, how do you compete with that, with the Zoom? Right now, well, let's Take phones first. Okay. Right now, we're selling millions and millions and millions of phones a year. Apple is selling zero phones a year. In six months, they'll have the most expensive phone by far ever in the marketplace. And let's see. You know, what's the expression? Let's see how the competition goes. In the case of music and entertainment players, Apple absolutely has a preeminent position. We said we want to be in this market. There's a lot of reasons why there's synergy with other things that we're doing. We think we've got some unique innovations, particularly what we're doing with community, with wireless networking. And we came into the market, a market in which they're very strong. And we took, I don't know, but I think most estimates would say we took about 20, 25 percent of the high end of the market. We weren't down at some of the lower price points, but for devices, $249 and over, we took, you know, let's say about 20 percent of the market. So I feel like we're in the game. We're driving our innovation hard, uh, and, uh, okay, we're not the incumbent. He's the incumbent in this game, but uh, at the end of the day, he's going to have to keep up with uh, an agenda that we're going to drive as well. And you still feel like you can be very competitive in that space? Sure, absolutely. If we but didn't think there was transformation going on, we wouldn't be playing.